Well, with all the rain that we have seen, neighbors say projects like these to depave areas of Nashville and convert them into green infrastructure to prevent flooding are already paying off. News Channel 5's Amanda Roberts shows us a bonus benefit that will also nourish our neighbors' bellies. With rain pouring on this Capitol View neighborhood. Pretty nice up there. I sat up there a couple of times and just relaxed and watched the view. An area that was previously pavement. One day I just seen them dig up the road. At first it was like a little hill you can drive up is now capturing both the attention of neighbors. Well, I love it already because there's people who've been sitting here on these benches by cats and humans alike. And capturing storm water that would otherwise cause problems. It's always flooding right here in this area, right there in the little gutter right beside it. There's nothing going on today over there, so yeah. <laughs> At least the right Hopefully now. it stays. I actually think this is my favorite time to come and see it because it's just an excellent demonstration of like seeing all this rainfall just slowly hit the soil and be absorbed in the soil versus all being uh, generated as runoff. It's been four months since the Cumberland River Compact and partners removed 4,800 square feet of pavement here. A lot of Nashville is paved and a lot of that pavement is necessary for our urban lifestyles, but not all of it. Organic soil material replaced asphalt for stormwater management, also making the ground fertile for fruit trees. Serviceberry are an excellent small ornamental tree that's common in Middle Tennessee. Every May or June, they create a really delicious edible fruit. It tastes like blueberries. Um, they're great to, you know, dress your oatmeal with or create a pie. So um, they're a really delicious and heavy fruiter. It's one of the nonprofit's first fruit tree forests they hope will give back year after year by protecting and feeding its neighbors. Oh my, that's very beautiful. That's like we got our own personal garden. Reporting in Nashville, I'm Amanda Roberts for News Channel 5.